hello everyone welcome back to our channel we are back again with a new video we are back with another 7 python automation script that makes your life easier so today we'll show you 7 practical python automation scripts that will make your daily life and workflow much easier whether you are a student or a developer or a tech enthusiast this is going to be very helpful for you all so let's start so the first one is rename multiple files okay so the first one is to rename multiple files so for this firstly we'll import os and then we'll give the files we need to rename so these are the files we'll rename them okay so this is a simple example that how we'll rename our file so here we'll use enumerate function which gives a counter starting at 1 we create new names dynamically in a real folder you would replace files with os list directory folder so now we'll see the output of this so as we can see our re images are renamed and now we'll move on to the second one which is auto summarize our csv file okay so for this firstly we'll import pandas as pd and then we'll create the data frame okay so this will give you a summary table showing mean minimum and max and pandas dot data frame this simulates your csv file and describe function gives instant stats super useful and super helpful for quick data analysis so let's see the output of this so as we can see the output of this how it summarizes the data in a csv file and now we'll move on to the third one so the third one is remove duplicate entries okay so for this we'll import the library pandas and we'll create a data frame so this is the simple data frame we created and now we'll clean it to remove the duplicate files okay so here draw duplicate function removes the repeated rows instantly it is great for cleaning data in seconds so let's see the output so as you can see it removed the duplicate data and it printed the original and unique values only so now let's move on to the fourth one which is display current time and date automatically so for this firstly we'll import the date time module so this imports the date time module okay so here we imported the date time module and strf time function formatted nicely and which is useful for reports and logs and date time dot nor function fetches the exact system time so let's see the output of this so as you can see it gave us the current date and time also and now we'll move on to the next one which is convert text to pdf this is also very important so for this firstly we'll import fpdf from fpdf module so here add page adds the page and this sends the font so what happens here is fpdf is an easy and lightweight library to convert pdf into text and text into pdfs so it is perfect for auto generating small reports or notes so this creates a file note.pdf in your working directory so let's see its output so here we can see our pdf is saved as note.pdf in our working directory and now we'll move on to the next one which is the sixth one so it is search for a word in multiple text files so for this firstly we'll import globe it is library and now we'll give the keyword so here we'll just find the keyword which is present in the file so we'll see the output of this as globe dot globe text this lists all the text file and reads each file and searches for your keyword it's like mini search engine so as you can see the output 
of this mini search engine and now we'll move on to the seventh one the seventh one is generate a random password so for that we'll import ra string and random and now we'll define the characters so this is we are defining that we need our password to include all these things okay so it generates a random password of 10 digits character so here ascii string letters this define letters and digits and punctuations and random dot sample picks 10 random one no repeats it is great for quick secure password generation so as we can see our password is generated with 10 unique digits or 10 unique items we can say so if you like this video do like share subscribe for more python videos and thanks for watching today's video